hey guys welcome back to next gen block uh, and in this video i want to show you how you can create floating emojis in vstc free video editor now it's actually super easy to create floating emojis in vstc so without further delay let's get started and see how you can do this now to do this first you will require a transparent image of the emoji which you are going to float so for the sake of this tutorial i've downloaded this particular transparent image of this emoji and i will be using this image in my tutorial so let me just go back to my editor and the first thing which you need to do is you need to add a sprite object so go to add object select sprite and then click on ok now mark your sprite object on top of the screen like this and look inside the sprite object settings which is present inside the properties window inside use as container currently no is selected so that's fine inside show effects no is selected so change this from no to yes and inside fill background yes is selected so change this from yes to no i would also like to click on this particular option which is set the same size as the parent has perfect Next, what you need to do is you need to double click on the sprite object and then go to video effects, go to nature, select particles and then click on OK. Now look inside the particles effect settings which is present inside the properties window and right here you will find this image option where currently not assigned is there. So you need to click on this browse option which is present on the extreme right of the image option so click on this browse option now select your transparent image of the emoji which you plan to float so right here is my transparent image of the emoji which i had showed you earlier now click on open perfect now look below and right here you will find this wind angle option where currently the value is zero so change this from 0 to 90 inside wind strength currently the value is 10 so that's fine inside start without particles currently true is selected so that's fine as well inside linear movement once again true is selected so that's fine inside size of particle currently the value is 2.5 so change this from 2.5 to 5 and then press enter inside maximum number of particles currently the value is 128 so change this from 128 to 64 and then press enter inside use layers currently true is selected so that's fine inside blur levels currently the value is 15 so change this from 15 to 3 and then press enter and finally inside rotate object currently true is selected so change this from true to false and that's it and so now if i just quickly play the video for you as you can see I've successfully created floating emojis in VSTC. Now you can use this effect in a video as well. So let me just show you how you can do that. So let me just go back to the main editing timeline and let me just import a demo video. So let me just go to add object and let me just click on video. now let me just select a demo video and click on open and finally click on ok perfect now double click on the sprite object click on this particles effect press ctrl x to cut this effect go back to the main editing timeline double click on your demo video and now let me just press ctrl v to paste the particles effect inside my video like this perfect 
and so now if I just quickly play the video for you perfect perfect so this is how you can create floating emojis in VSTC free video editor do let me know your thoughts in the comment section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video till then thanks for watching